first round. I knocked him down too. Yeah, yeah. won the first round. <laughs> and he was out of gas after the first round. And Clay Hodges won the second and third round and he lost the fight. And and I went back to the dressing room and he had his chin on his chest. And and he, he was thinking actually, I, I, I read in his autobiography by George, he was thinking about quitting boxing. And I said, that's all right, George, you're gonna be a good fighter someday. Never knowing, not only a good fighter, but a legend for the ages. And so, so 52 years I've been privileged to know this man, and he's one of the greatest people on the planet. Now, Bill, Bill had on a tuxedo, so I thought he owned the place. I said, <laughs> and I was wow, telling everybody the what owner. to do. I yeah. said, the owner, yeah, he was telling everybody what to do. I said, man, the owner believe I got it. You made it. Where'd you, where'd you get all your power from? Because your power is sick. It's something not normal. And that's the only thing I don't understand yet. From the fifth Where the world? Where the I, power came from? I think I it was know. from the streets of the Fifth Ward in Houston. He got his power. That's just the people who love you and support you if they want to. Hey, love <laughs> you back. Okay. <laughs> George, thank you. Okay, see you later. Good to see you tonight. Okay. What do you feel about this fight, uh, Big George? Good fight. Best fight that can happen. Who Who do you favor? Canelo Alvarez. <laughs> Decision, KO, how? Ah. Uh, It'll probably be a decision because he's not going to be crazy and throw everything away. So thank you, George. Appreciate.